Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to another brand new episode of Fisher Online. <clears throat> and today is the last day we are uh, concluding our tour at Scotland Lock Morrow. Today, once again, we are going to try for the last time to troll this map. Uh, last episode, I mentioned that Wolf did fix uh, the trolling and how the rods go haywire. But unfortunately, when I did record last episode after the patch... My rods were still going crazy and I did not catch any fish at all. So uh, he did reply to my video and uh, this time I am going to try one more time. It could be uh, that for some reason team either didn't update my game like it was supposed to or the changes didn't take effect. I don't know. But all I know is I, uh, I, I did the trolling the day after the patch came into effect so it's not like i was doing it before uh today i'll be using the gt5 on two rods and the gt4 on one rod if you saw last episode gt5 is absolutely amazing it's also on the weeklies i am going to be trolling oh god let's zoom out here this hole over here this entire width so it's going to be five and six f and g f and g five and six that's where we're going to go. It is 7 a.m. or 7... I think it's 7 a.m. I really hope it's 7 a.m. We're going to take the three rod holder boat. And we're going to go. It is bright. Oh, yes. That is morning time, isn't it? That has to be. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, I'm going to make my way there. All right. So here we are. Oh, we got a fish. You can see how these two rods are going insane. Uh, but we finally have a fish on. I'm so happy for that. Uh, it is the first time I was finally able to come here during morning time. Because the last two times <clears throat> I came here, uh, it was always one. The first time was, I think, night time. The second time it was late afternoon into evening. So I did not catch any fish at all. Uh, but as you can see, the rods are clearly not fixed. And I will show you one more time. We are in the very deep spot using the GT5 and uh, I think the last one had the GT4. So I don't know what's going on, but uh, Wolf is going to have a look and uh, he's going to let us know. This is the second rod right out right now. This is the setup and then the third one with the GT4. So I'm going to keep trolling some other two rods can ho hopefully hook onto a fish. This should be prime time. Alright, what is this going to be? Is this going to be a big fat salmon? Good thing it hit our heaviest rod too. Alright, I'm going to keep fighting. Please hit that like button. Please subscribe if you haven't already for more. Uh, Fisher Online RF4. Other fishing video games. If you have any suggestions, please let me know. And uh, comment below what you think. Have you had any luck at Lockmar? I'm so happy I forced myself to stay here. Uh, Red Car WTF, thank you so much guys for helping me out as well with the spots. And I'm so happy I was able to make this map work and find some good spots. Oh, that was a beautiful jump. It's too bad it's foggy. I think it might be a pike. I'm not too sure. But, uh, yeah, I really hope trolling here works. I hope this isn't the only fish I catch for the next half hour. So. Yeah, let's see how it goes. We almost have this bad boy. Ooh, I can't wait. Look at it. On the surface, trying to jump around. I don't want to look at the map. Uh-oh. What's happening? It's 8 a.m., right? Like, well, what's going on? I'm, I'm getting worried here. Wow, what is... Oh, that's a salmon. Thirteen point nine kg large salmon. Wow, that took far longer because uh, we are we are trolling. So, yeah. 
the other two rods are spazzing out, but my the, the first one I recasted is not. So let me just recast this again. Maybe, oh, nope. There we go. You see the first one? It hit the bottom, and now it's spazzing out too, and we're still in the deep hole. So, definitely not fixed, I would say. Alright. Rod number two. All right, friction break. I know this one. I didn't mess with the friction break. So I can do one more notch here. Uh, this is our 30 kg setup. Okay. <clears throat> so let's see what this guy is. Not a big salmon at all. But... But, good news, I have a fish on our other rod, too. What? Oh. Scared me. I'm like, what happened? Alright, this is our 18 kg setup. Thankfully, a small fish hit it on the GT4. Uh, I really hope it's one of the, the rare trouts. What is this? Please do not be an arctic. That looks like an arctic. Oh, it's an orkney char. Sadly, it is in on marker though. But I'll take it anyway. Another small one here. Not a fight at all. You know, I like it, but I'm also kind of questioning it. How our bigger rod gets big fish, our smaller rods get smaller fish. Uh, the lure is the exact same on all on these two rods, this, you know, 29 and 40 kg rod. They both have the same lure. And uh, the hook size should be the same as well. So, <clears throat> somewhat of a big arctic char here. That looks really big, but it's probably going to be hopefully 10 kg, I hope. Or 12 kg. And yes, our big rod has a fish on. Oh, all of our rods have a fish on now. Man, look at that color on this thing. 12 kg. Mmm. I like it. Alright. Look what's here. <clears throat> Nothing big. That's good. I'd like to catch other species of salmon too, but... If this is what we get, then whatevs. Salmon, char, you know the thing. All the fish. Uh, but the others are being caught on bait. So float or bottom, mostly bottom, I would say, fishing. Alright, what's on you, sir? DT4, you're the exciting one. We know you're going to catch something different, hopefully. Because uh, the GT5 catches mainly salmon... Arctic char and uh, pike. But the GT4 has a chance of catching other smaller trouts. That looks like a brook trout, hopefully. Oh, I really hope you're a brook. Large Orkney char. Wow, that is a large. Oh my god. Please don't tell me 3 kg is a trophy size for this. That is pretty darn cool. Oh, we're almost at that, and I gotta turn around. <laughs> I'm screwed. Oh, uh, man, the smaller rod is gonna get spooled. 12 kg. Let's turn the boat that way. Maybe we can save ourselves here. I don't know. Alright. Hello, number three, number three. Did we lose the fish? No, we still have it. Did we just get hit on the other one? Oh man, I can't drive this boat when I have the fish on. See, I, I try to sit. It won't let me. I'll have to put the rod down in order to do that. But let's see what this fish does. Um, this is our smallest rod. So, you know, this could probably be like a 18 kg fish and it could probably spool us. So, don't really care. 
Uh, but I'll try. I will try and well, I'll see you in, uh, in right now, actually. All right, not a long fight at all. <clears throat> Unfortunately, that guy looks small. So. Let's see. 13 kg, okay, okay. Respectable, respectable. At the same time, we have something on this guy. Oh man, we did. We did, but it got away. That is fine. Let's go back home. Uh, I have been fishing 35 to 45 minutes, I would say. So, not bad at all. We're gonna check how much monies we made. That the issue is I can never tell how long I've been fishing for because I always forget to keep track of time. I know I've been saying this for years now. Um, so I, I I really think I've been fishing for 35 to 45 minutes. It's definitely not been an hour. And we've made 670 silver, which is pretty darn good. Look at this. This large Orkney char, 2.7 kgs, 114 silver. Wowzers. Large Atlantic's not worth too much. Look at the Arctic, it's worth way more. Uh, but you can see the difference. 12.552 and 12.4, huge difference. Uh, even this non-marker is 11 silver, pretty cool. Orkney Char, man, I would have loved to have an Orkney Char trophy. Uh, but I love the smaller Chars and Trouts that are on this map. They are really cool and you have a... You have a really good chance of catching large ones too. And a decent chance at a trophy, I would say. So, in all, I would say I'm extremely happy with Scotland. Finally, I'm able to figure it out. We've got the fish, all the fish that we've wanted to catch. Um, in terms of trolling, honestly, uh, in the previous episode, before this one, where we went close to the ruin and fished for salmon there, that spot is way better than trolling itself. Um, so if I had the chance, I would probably go back to the ruin and, and fish there. Uh, cause you can catch everything there. Uh, you can spin fish with one rod and catch huge Atlantic salmon. And with the other two rods, you can put baits on and catch the Orkney chars, the different types of chars, um, and white fish and all the fun stuff. So you can do so much more there. So, uh, do give it a shot. Let me know how it worked for you. Uh, next episode, I already know where I want to go. Uh, but one map, guys, that's remaining that I haven't been able to successfully fish, if I remember correctly, is Netherlands. It's one big river, and it's only shore fishing, and I remember I went there several times, and I got absolutely nothing. I struggled there. If you guys know any spots, if you know, if you have any suggestions where you've had good fishing, with bait, spot, clip, anything, please let us know in the comments here or on our Discord channel in the Fisher Online section. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this helped you. Like, subscribe, comment. Bye.